hey guys so today is the 27th of november it's also black friday and today marks about a week since i told sean about my pea stickies um, and it's such an amazing experience it's it's dreadful also because i haven't informed the family yet the reason why i haven't informed the family yet is because of the industry that i'm in um i can still work up until i'm four or five months so um and because i'm you know my my life is so public i i wanted to it's really killing me not to phone my mother and tell her but i wanted to tell his um, parents and my parents and my siblings and his siblings together in one space to kind of also explain to them the confidentiality around it it's not um, because i don't want things put on social media and those types of things um, contracts I have involved with alcohol brands and those types of things I still need to sort out from my side so um, that is the reason why I have not told anybody and my mother is someone if I had to tell her the entire, the entire family would have known already and because we are celebrating our fifth year anniversary on the um, 12th of December this year which is in two weeks time we've decided to um, do the announcement then we are having a little Sunday lunch at home with our immediate family um, Apart from that I have my first kindness appointment book for my eight-week scan um, Which we hopefully will be able to hear yeah, what we do ready um, It is still quite early. So it's it's we might we might not um, but it will just be our first scan um, to confirm that everything's still okay so our eight week scan it will actually be eight and a half weeks when i go that was also the strangest thing i thought i was two weeks pregnant but i'm actually six weeks pregnant so um on the 9th of december i will be doing my first scan and then on the 12th i will be able to at least have a little picture and show my my family the big news so um last week friday at after eight o'clock when i got the blood test confirming my pregnancy um, I went to an event there often luckily it was an all halal event so there was no alcohol it was a bit easier friends of mine wanted to go for drinks after I said oh you know I'm a bit busy um, that evening I had cocktails at the grill father um, if you guys are watching this now now you would know why I was drinking non-alcoholic cocktails um, I just pretended you know that I have to drive and things like that um, this week um, today is the Benali clothing launch in Outway today. Luckily the event is quite far from our place so I have the exclusive event to say that I'm driving. Tomorrow I have a bachelorette which is freaking me out because I'm going to be around my best friend Michelle Afki whom I haven't said anything to yet. Only because I want to make the um, announcement very special to her and to all of my friends. So I've been in contact with Leslie, with Candace, um, with Joinita. I've been I've been speaking to them this entire week. I've been in contact with Valencia Addison with our bridal campaign that we are busy with. So it's been really, really difficult to not say anything. Um, but um, I want everybody to feel as excited as I am when I do tell them. I don't want to do it over the phone. I want to, I want to see them in person. So yeah, I'm extremely excited. That is where we are right now. Um, Sunday is Lily's third birthday, um, it's a pool party so we're most likely going to have some cocktails again which I have to manipulate but I will show you what Sean had done with my drinks, he's very creative. So um, yeah, that's, he is really on board, we bought some more vitamins for me, we stocked up our fridge today on some things that will increase my iron because I am anemic already. Um, and the baby needs lots more iron during this time so we've increased our diets to more beetroots and um, I'm trying to cut down on carbs because it makes me extremely nauseous not nauseous but it, it gives me so much heartburn so crazy foods and carbs makes me feel a bit sick so um, it's figuring out all these things now my husband went and bought me a blender from Black Friday at clicks it was extremely cheap so um, I'm going to start incorporating lots of smoothies and um, juicing as well. So yeah, this is such an amazing experience. My life has changed forever. Um, 
I think the worry will probably never go away. I now understand everything that my mother, like every nag, every nagging SMS or every nagging phone call I used to get when I was out, um, I understand it now. Um, I'm only six weeks pregnant and already every, it's on my mind every single day. Um, I do, oh, I don't want to cry. I do, however, wish that Sean's father was here to experience this with us because he was looking forward to us having kids. Um, so I think that would that is the saddest part of this process. So, um, but I'm sure he's watching us and he's excited with the process and because we are being so secretive, he knows already what's going on. Um, and yeah let's see what happens from here